Redo! <laughs> Hey and welcome to InfoGamer. In this video we're going to be showing you how to add the animation on the Doodle Jump character that's found on your main menu screen. This is our first animation video for the playlist and so stay tuned so you know how to put the animations into your own main menu screen. Make sure you have your main menu scene selected and since we already, since I already do, I'm going to go to the, our animations folder if you don't have one of those, right click the assets folder and create folder, then rename it animations. Okay, we have our animations folder selected, then go to your doodle jump guy or the thing that you want to animate. And over here in the inspector view, there's this add component button. We're going to want to select that, which brings down a pull down menu and there's this tab that says miscellaneous then select animation and it adds an animation component to our doodle jump character. Then we're going to want to open up an animation window so we can add it, edit the animation. So go to window and select animation or control 6. Then select create because we have our doodle jump guy selected, this is going to create an animation on the thing that we have selected. So let's call this doodle jump. Ooh, Miss Bell. Save it. And then it, it opens, it adds this feature where we can edit our animation. This red bar is the timeline for what our animation is going to do. So when we just move the doodle jump guy up a little bit and put him back down, this sets a keyframe for this position. Right where you drop him off is where he's going to start jumping from. Well, he's not jumping yet, but let's move this over just a little bit and bring him all the way up to the top of his jump. And this is going to be where he, how high he jumps on the main menu scene. Then we're just going to move it over a little bit more and bring him down to land on the platform. And there, you're, you're pretty close to being done with that. So we can exit this. We're going to have to drag in this new animation that we just created onto our doodle jump guy. But we're going to drag it into the animation component we, we added before this. And just drag it in right here by the animation. Once you've dragged our animation onto the character, it's going to register that animation in the play when we play the game. So let's hit play. Did you see a move? That wasn't that wasn't very much of a, a movement, but we're we're gonna fix that so you can actually see it. It's so fast it just pops up and down real quick. So let's fix that by selecting our animation and there's this wrap mode and there's a couple different options here we're going to want the loop option so that it will continue to replay the animation over and over again in a loop so we hit play again look at that he's like <laughs> he's he's really happy doodle jump guy it's it's a speed version of our doodle jump game all right, so that's, that might be a little bit too fast for you, but we can slow them down really easily. And how we do that is just make sure you're still selected, the doodle jump guy, hit control six, or go back up to the window in the, in the menu bar, and hit animation. Then all you have to do is select these and drag them out a little bit farther. And you can play around with these keyframes to see what you like better. You don't even have to exit this window. And whoop. Yeah, you don't even have to exit this window. You can just edit these keyframes and hit play again and see how you changed it. So now we slowed down a little bit. We can keep moving it out a little bit farther. See what we got there. 
Nice. He's slowing down a little bit. Oh, now he's way slow. Welcome back. Thanks for watching. I didn't realize how easy it was to put an animation on your main screen, but it's not too not too hard. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. Listen, make sure you subscribe. We'll catch you next time. Bingo. Added footage. Moving him right a little bit. Let's see what this does. <laughs> what the? <laughs> if we, uh, we could make him even try to disappear. If we delete this right here, and let's see if he disappears in there for a second. Well, yeah, he's just continually jumping to the black hole and respawning. Nice. But for this though, we're just gonna have him jump straight up and down because we're gonna, we wanna make it look almost like the doodle jump game. Cool. And that's good enough for me. We'll, we'll maybe slow it down just a little bit more. Cool. Let's see how that goes. That's all it takes to create a small animation for your game. If you want to edit the bugs and make a little animation for them, feel free to do that.